Hi, I'm Carly, and by the end of this video series, you'll be ready to take on a variety of amazing iron-on projects with your brand new Cricut Easy Press 2. In this video, we'll give you a tour of the machine and its features, and in subsequent videos, we'll get into the good stuff, like prepping your workspace, applying a design, and much more. Okay, let's get started. First things first, the Cricut Easy Press 2 comes in three unique sizes, and while of course you can use any of them for any size project, each one was designed with a specific use in mind. The 6x7 is perfect for pint-sized projects like baby clothes or accessories. The 9x9, of course, for your everyday essentials like t-shirts and totes. And this amazing 10x12 for your jumbo-sized projects. All of them come with a safety base and a welcome booklet. And all models heat up hotter than ever, up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Once you plug it in and power it on, it only takes a minute or two to reach your desired temperature, so be prepared. The temperature and time settings appear in this window. By default, it always reverts to the settings you last used. Holding this thermometer button down toggles between Celsius or Fahrenheit. And to set the temperature, just press this button until the numbers start flashing. To speed up the process, hold down the plus or minus to jump in increments of 10 degrees. The timer button works the same way. Once it flashes, set the time using the plus and minus buttons. You can reach your number faster by pressing and holding. The Cricut C button stays orange until it reaches the temperature you set. When the beep sounds and the button turns green, you're ready to go. And the last thing, if your machine is sitting for 10 minutes, you'll hear a triple beep to signify it's about to turn off automatically as a safety precaution. If you happen to still be crafting, just touch any button and that'll keep it awake. In the next video, we'll talk about the ideal surface to use for your iron-on projects and how to prep your workspace.